one dirty secret of accepting or not accepting invitations is we're all shallow enough to look at, at first who else is going. Um, and it, you have an incredible lineup of people I respect and I want to listen to. It's very clear that the people who are here as members of the audience are really engaged and interested in learning and are hoping to draw off some life lessons that would be really useful to them. I think it's one of the few conferences in Toronto, really in Canada, where you can come and you can meet sort of a wide array of investors and the investors, whether it's family offices or pension plans, or um, it's really the best of the best. conferences that I've attended are intended to make money. This one is, but for the right purpose. And when you combine that, I think it makes it very special. And uh, I think the quality of people, minus myself of course, that are speaking here today, I think it's testimony to that. If you look at the networking opportunity alone, it's gold. You know, independent of everything else that you get from it. So, world class networking opportunity and the roster of speakers to me is as good as any I've seen. So, pretty nice combination. If you're doing anything in the investing world, this is definitely a conference that you want to be at. I think this event is really great. It gives you, you know, a very intimate conversation with some of the world's best investors right now. I thought they had a host of incredible speakers, and it was great to be able to, you know, talk with Steve and really get his story on how he became such a titan. Just a huge thanks to Prime Quadrant for their incredible support of Sick Kids. Delighted to close out the 2017 Prime Quadrant Conference. It's been a absolute whirlwind. The speakers were fantastic. The attendees were through the roof, overjoyed with their experience, how much they learned, the quality of the people that they've met, and the amount of money that we raised. I am so honored and privileged to be a part of this event.